wait a little bit, okay? You wait to see if there's any spontaneous movement of the tongue. Open a little bit more. Okay, so just to make sure it's stabilized. And then you start with the snout. And you see that movement of the snout reflex. Then you can do also... You begin to look at it's beautiful because the tongue go is attracted towards the side of stimulation, not that much. Yeah, a little bit this one. Sucking is from up to down, from super to inferior on the super lips. It's all of them, okay? So you can again look for the area of stimulation. Yeah, it's a little bit on the brain, but again, I think we're gonna go on the spinal cord. On the side, and we got this very nice area of reactivity right there. And so, often, it's something that happens early in a mm -hmm. So, we can see if he reorganizes a little bit. His neck begins to move a little bit, he reorganizes cervicals. Here we go, you see, you relax the muscle, paraspinal muscle, and the cervicals, the hips and the sacrum are organized too. I do nothing, I see him turning. And because it's very, very old, probably, from my in embryo and it looks like it's frozen actually. It looks like it's really doing some kind of frozen reaction. So you wait until it unfrozen it. <laughs> That's make the change of of stage. So it's going maybe from frozen to more uh, fight or flight or at least to more sympathetic reaction. He's more alive. So he was a front so on the table. So, still a bit. Ah. It's nice, the last breath was very nice. Almost the end of the process, and this one also. Now he's not frozen, he's more into more into neutral, he breathes nicely, he's more he's present, he wants to be present. And at the end of the process. So now stay there, let's see. Let's see if we were test. Open your mouth a little bit, same thing. Yeah, open your mouth. No movement of the tongue. No more movement. <laughs>